What to Play presents the 16 upcoming games for June 2019, arranged by release dates. There's a new Warhammer game coming, and it's definitely unlike all the others. For the first time ever, the series explores the exciting ARPG format in their own familiar universe. Take on the role of a soldier, dwarf, or elf in their four classes and train their swords and staffs against their large bestiary of monsters and bosses. As a modern-day ARPG, Warhammer Chaos Bane has a focus on the co-op experience, letting you play alongside with up to three of your friends locally or online. Having the feel of a classic isometric RPG and the satisfying combat of newer releases, Chaos Bane should be on the list for any ARPG fan. Heralded by its deluxe version in May, the standard version is coming out on PC, PS4, and Xbox One on June 1st. ...is a very powerful foe. Mutalifs are abominations, mutated by the power of chaos and infused with magic, making them much more difficult to defeat. To help, we'll activate Bloodlust, a devastating skill that gives you extra speed and new powers for a limited time. The duration and number of new skills is based on your bloodlust level, so you'll have to choose the best time to unleash your fury. Persona Q2 New Cinema Labyrinth When it comes to milking their franchise, there's nothing stopping JRPG Masters Atlas from making more Persona games. Now that Persona 5 is still making waves in the market, it's time they reintroduce their chibi-filled spin-off in the sequel to Shadow of the Labyrinth. Q2 introduces you all to your favorite Persona characters from 3 and 4 alongside 5's Phantom Thieves. Dive deep into this mysterious new cinema sec and chart the map to overcome its ever-changing dungeons easily. It's basically a fan service game made for the hardcore Persona fans and it's set to release this June 4 on the 3DS. Cooking Simulator They say the kitchen is a chef's playground, and for wannabe cooks still taking their baby steps, Big Cheese Studios' virtual kitchen will have to do. Simulating a fancy kitchen set fit for Gordon Ramsay, it boasts the whole shebang of ovens, stoves, and packed pantry, all rendered in ultra-realistic graphics. Start from scratch from the most basic dishes and steady your grip to prepare them amid their full physics engine. The kitchen is all yours for slicing, blending, cooking, and all the fun explosions and breakdowns that come with. It's set to release on the PC on June 6th. MotoGP 19 with their text field straight to the point Apple ad-like announcement trailer, MotoGP promises to do better. Literally making history, MotoGP 19's new features include historical challenges that let you jump into the shoes of the greatest professional riders in the sport's most iconic moments. Along with a blast of the past, it is a look to the future with a neural AI that makes opponents as smart and as fast as you can be. All that plus dedicated servers for lower latencies and a race director mode. MotoGP 19 is looking pretty good and let's just hope they can keep their promises. Coming out this June 6th on the PC, PS4, Xbox One, and on the Switch. Dragon Star Varnir. The power of the dragon lies before you in this stellar new JRPG from Idea Factory International. Set in a world where beasts roam the land, take control of a daring protagonist as he embraces the importance of life after being reborn. Featuring a vertically oriented battle system, use your dragonborn abilities to perform dazzling mid-air combat and transform into a powerful being. With the help of witches, embark on a grand adventure to save his kind from being decimated by an evil empire. This fresh title offers something new and familiar to veterans of the JRPG genre. It's coming out this 11th of June on the PlayStation 4. Mini Mech Mayhem Future Lab whips up something different in this cute little PSVR exclusive. Far from the fast-paced nature of their previous titles, Velocity 2X and Tiny Tracks, Mini Mech Mayhem is a friendly exercise in robot buddy destruction. Gathering player avatars around a grid-based battlefield, work together with your tiny mechs as you plan out strategies and they do all the rest. Looking colorful and friendly with their vibrant virtual hub, Mini Mech Mayhem looks like it has just enough of fierce competition to keep you wanting more. Set to release exclusively on the PS4 on June 18th. Solar Warden Polar Zenith's real-time strategy game is mixed with sci-fi space shooter mechanics. 
Your main objective is simple. Command your fleet called the Solar Warden to combat the Silicoid Menace. Developed by the people behind Mech Warrior Living Legends, expect more strategic elements as you pick which tactic to use during space battles. You can choose between commanding your fleet using a real-time strategy overlay, or personally take direct control of any of your vessels. In addition, its co-op, campaign, and heavy customization brings so much hours of content for anyone looking for a great space action game. It comes out this 20th of June on the PC. Short work of him getting in close and having my top turret actually take him out too. There we go. Yeah, take that, buddy. Yeah, let's launch some missiles against this exploder here. Hopefully they'll catch up. Steel Division 2. Just getting by with enough love, Yugen Systems decides to follow up the tactical World War II battles of Normandy 44 with a brand new installment. Packed with gradually added features of the first game and so much more, Steel Division 2 is looking to push the RTS genre once more. Set in the eastern front of the Red Army and the Axis powers, we'll all get a load of new units and divisions, game modes, and a new turn-based dynamic strategic campaign. Favorably received with just a few kinks in the first game, we have high hopes for the next as it is coming out this June 20th. Equipped with 10 PPSH. Our enemy stands no chance. We are sending tanks to the plateau to capture it with the help of the Guardia in the forest. Super Neptunia RPG The anthropomorphic Sega consoles are coming back for more dimensional and self-referential escapades. This latest entry to Idea Factory's long-running Hyperdimension series, we will see the return of Nep Nep, Noir, Vert, and the rest of the gang. Witness the awakening of Neptune in a new 2D world and help her break out of the boundaries of the planar dimension. This installment will get us diving into old school dungeons and switching out leaders in classic turn based battles. After facing a few delays, it finally gets an official release date of June 20th on the PC and June 25th on the PS4 and Switch. Crash Team Racing Nitro Fuel With the success of Crash's Insane Trilogy, it looks like Sony's iconic Bandicoot makes a grand return. This remaster of the critically acclaimed racing game takes us once again to the hectic and ridiculous competition that can make or break friendships. Nitro Fuel packs more fuel than its original which means better graphics and of course extra content. Its special edition called the Nitrous Oxide Edition adds more playable characters into the mix. This deluxe edition can let you play the missing characters from the original, including the nefarious Nitrous Oxide. It's coming out this 21st of June on the PS4, Xbox One, and Switch. Judgment. The upcoming action-adventure series from Sega is set in the Yakuza universe. Currently out in Japan, the game was at a standstill with the rest of the game's main actors. Nonetheless, it's still coming out to the western shores. Similar to the Yakuza games, it's played from a third-person perspective. Players will control a new character as he investigates a murder case, and players can still change into different styles and knock enemies in different ways. The biggest difference of this spin-off is the new investigation mode. Players can find traces of the criminal and the crime scenes. The major difference between this and the original Yakuza titles is its story. It might share the same world, but it tells a different narrative. It comes out this June 25 as a PlayStation 4 exclusive.
Monster Jam Steel Titans. Monster Trucks in 2019, THQ Nordic's Gargantuan showcase of real trucks performing real action is for everyone to enjoy. Hear the roar of its 25 iconic trucks including the Grave Digger and Max D. Experience the metallic mayhem as you demolish the environment around you with its satisfying destruction physics. With over 12 stadiums to choose from, get ready to flex on your monster truck driving skills and perform daredevil stunts. It's coming out this 25th of June on the PC, PS4, and Xbox One. Samurai Showdown Nothing like a trip back to memory lane. SNK's beloved classic makes a grand return to the modern generation platforms. It was one of those games that shaped the future of arcade and fighting games alongside Capcom Street Fighter. This reboot of the series takes players between the events of the original title and the fifth game. Powered by Unreal Engine 4, expect an improved presentation to the fighting game we once knew and loved. This fresh new entry in the series brings along all the familiar combat and characters from the original with of course its added twist. It's coming this 27th of June on the PS4 and Xbox One. The Sinking City to give players a bit more time to breathe in between the gorgeous releases last March, Frogware's love letter to HP Lovecraft's classic Eldritch Horrors has been moved to June. While they had their players in mind, it also gives their upcoming title a bit more time in the oven, what with their less than stellar previews. There's plenty of horrific content to mine in the pages of Lovecraft's Necronomicon, we're all waiting to see them all come to life in the eyes of private investigator Charles Reed. We're hoping Cthulhu finally wakes on June 27th on the PC, PS4, and Xbox One. This thick sackcloth is completely soaked with blood. Here's a good place for this garbage. Super Mario Maker 2 We just can't get enough of Mario games, and that rings true especially for the beloved Mario Maker series. Getting its second installment on the Nintendo Switch, return to the plumber's iconic adventures in stages made from your imaginations or the happy creators from around the world. In this sequel, not only does it have more Mario levels to build, players also get to create the fresh three-dimensional stages along with the classic 2D ones that everyone is so familiar with. Pre-order the game and you get a fancy new stylus to go along with it to level up the building excitement. Let your imaginations run wild and free once it comes out on June 28th. A breathtaking new entry to Codemasters F1 racing game, in development for nearly two years, this is not only the most ambitious game in franchise history, it also continues to rival the quality and production of its real-life race counterpart. F1 2019's new features include a new personalization feature where players can use their creativity in its multiplayer modes. Alongside its set of new updates, the game is still bringing the players more classic cars and a deeper career mode for all you wannabe racers out there. It comes out this 28th of June on the PC, PS4, and of course, the Xbox One. I think Bottas there, you saw. I think Bottas got held up by about 10, 15 seconds there. And so we're going to jump Bottas and get quite close to Hamilton now on this uh, safety guard restart. As everyone will bunch up, there's going to be a few people out of sync that did not pit under the safety guard. But the majority of the top 10 now, I think, are converting to a two stop as I've gone to super soft tires. Hamilton's done. Hey guys, that's all for today. My name is Raf. If you love the video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to become a certified What to Player. See ya. Thank mm -hmm. you.